guys, this is going to be a review of AC P3 Charged. Um, not specifically the orange flavor, I've tried the other flavors, watermelon and grape. Um, this is just the one I bought this time. Uh, and I really wanted to, to try it to see if I liked it enough to do a review on it. Um, I think I did a review on a couple other pre-workouts. I think I did one on Yeti. Um, I didn't do a video review of a couple of them, um, but I've been taking pre-workouts for, oh gosh, on and off for about a year and a half to two years, um, and this one by far is the best. Uh, the only known place, like actual storefront, you can get it at, I'm pretty sure right now, is just GNC. Um, I think it's like 60 bucks if you're not a GNC Gold Card member. But if you are, it's like 49 bucks. Um, and I'm not like endorsed by GNC, but I would definitely recommend getting a GNC card if you are going to be buying um, a lot of pre-workouts, especially this kind, just because it does save you money. Um, the reason I was interested in this is because it has the creatine magna powder in it. Um, most pre-workouts on the market have just one sort of creatine. Um, monohydrate, I believe. I'm not entirely sure. Don't don't quote me on that. Um, but here's just some of the stuff that's in it. Uh, this is just the orange flavor. Uh, the ingredients are relatively the same uh, up until you get to the flavoring, obviously. Um, it says 60 servings. I don't know if you can. I don't know if, where it went. 60 servings. Um, that is if you do one scoop with it. Uh, I do too, just because I built up a little bit of a tolerance for it. Um, but with that being said, uh, I don't get nearly as jittery with this stuff as I do with uh, like C4 or Jack 3D. Um, flavor is, is excellent um, in all the flavors I've tried, and this is the third one I tried, watermelon and grape. Um, every single flavor has been excellent. Uh, I think watermelon's my favorite so far. Um, mixability is pretty good too. I mean, with with all sorts of powders and stuff, you're gonna have some residue in the bottom that doesn't mix 100%, but that's to be expected. Um, a cool thing with this is uh, it has a cap on the little scoop, so that way if you're not mixing it into a blender bottle, um, and you're just mixing it into a regular water bottle, uh, you don't have to get a funnel to funnel it in. You just scoop it up, close the cap, pour it into your your workout bottle. Um, like I said, I didn't really get that many jitters. Uh, I think everybody uh, reacts to the ingredients in here differently. So uh, that may not be true for you. Um, but I definitely recommend ACG3 Charged. Great, great pre-workout. Um, I feel, definitely can feel it at the gym. I can feel like I can do a lot more reps and heavier weight. Um, now that's to a point. Obviously, I'm not going to be, you know, benching 300, but I can do, you know, 225, 250 uh, a lot longer than I can when I don't take this. Um, that being said, I wouldn't recommend taking it for over a month. Uh, I think there's a warning on, yeah, there's a warning on all of them saying uh, don't take um, longer than a 30 day period uh, and that's just for your health and safety obviously taking this, um, you know, can affect your health seeing as I don't think any of these pre-workouts are FDA approved so you are taking them at your own risk. Um, what I usually do is take two or three days on and then three or four days off. Um, when I have my intense workouts, I'll take it for a week straight. That's very rarely. Um, but then after, I'll, I'll just go without pre-workout. Um, and that, that, this will last me a lot longer than uh, a month, even though I do double up on servings. It'll last me about a month and a half, just because I'm not taking it every single time I go to the, go to the gym. Uh, I do also take protein after the gym. Uh, I'll do another video on that if you guys want. Um, but definitely give this product a try if you're in the market for a pre-workout. 
Um, it is pretty pricey if you're not a GNC member. Um, but if you can find it online for cheap, you know, that's always an option. But uh, just be careful with it and uh, don't overuse it. But I, I definitely give this product a 9 out of 10.